Folks, this is uh, Craters of Jordan, I think, you know, all the volcanic looking stuff. And all right. Anyway, me and my buddy, that's my buddy there, Robert. Me and my buddy, he come to see me. Oh, there's a rock. Rock. I'll see you. I think I am. That's a big mother. It's a big rock. <laughs> I know, I like these little uh, caves here. I think it was gushing. I think it was Gushin volcanic material. Melted on one side. Oh, it's got something in there, huh? Super light. Yeah, sure. Alright. Sweet. Alright, we're gonna walk up this pile here. <laughs> yeah, this is actually yeah, a volcano. Yeah, it's not a volcano to me, baby. It blew its top though. Alright. Wait, what do you call these vents or? A lava tube, yeah. A lava vent or something. Oh, I see. Okay. Lava tubes. Jump down in there, give me that rock, okay? <laughs> oh, don't do that. <laughs> It's probably deep. This might be another spot where it blew its top, huh? A lot of iron in there, but that's kind of normal. Is that real life? Yeah. <laughs> it's like pumice stone, man. It's funny. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Wow. Wow, that is a deep one, it looks like, huh? I wonder how deep that is. I gotta be stuck. Yeah, this stuff is crazy how light it is, right? It's like uh it's like pumice stone or something, right? I mean it's super light, right? Super light. Anyway, cool. He's pretty fast, I better quit perking around. Lava tube. You can see that it's round here, right? Hollow, right? My buddy, he pointed out to me too that if you look right here, you can see this piece right here is kind of gray looking. And then this was a whole lava tube, right? You can see the folds in it out here. And then it caved in here, but it kind of ran all along here like a little river, right? Of lava when she was cooking. And of course, you see the insides, I've got all the kind of grayish looking material. And the outside, of course, is exposed to sun and air and whatnot. And of course, uh... oh, would you land on this stuff? <laughs> Ow! It's hard to walk up here. He's okay. I'm good. I'm good. <laughs> I'm good. Am I still rolling? <laughs> yeah, cracking the screen. 
only one damage. Okay, I gotta get you right side. That's another looking cool one, man. Look at that. You got a good a good view of it, right? You got this one here. Alright. Listen to that. Alright. Alright, it's like hollow as can be. Very cool looking though. That was broke too, but yeah, no more falling down. I fell down and cut myself a little bit. But this stuff is really grippy, man. I'll tell you what. What now? That's okay. It'll bleed over in a minute. Once I bleed out, it'll go away. <laughs> well, that's a good idea. Safety first. <laughs> now I'm walking on this vent tube, right? This is scary because this thing could cave in, right? Might be 40 feet down. Probably not. I grabbed something here on the way out. There's so much of it here, man. It's like a million, zillion, trillion tons of it. This is about six ounces, maybe. This looks better than my welds. Right here, right? Yeah, Mother Nature knows how to run a bead, man. Yeah, good. Of course, there's a tube underneath that, right? Isn't that wild. Mother Nature's cooking. I ain't looking at my phone no more. I'm either recording it or not. <laughs> I gotta watch where I'm going. It's almost done. Now that's a cool looking tube there too. Again. Started to step on one. If somebody stepped on this one and caved right through, that's definitely a footprint, I bet you. Alright. So yeah, you gotta be careful. Look at that tube right up there. Oh yeah, oh my gosh, yeah, look at that. That did, it started way up there. It ran all along here, around the corner. Wow, that's pretty cool. Very cool.